Ever wondered what it would be like to play a vampire in a video game? Well, today's that day. I spend 100 days in V Rising, going from a singular castle heart in lands unknown to building a small base with all the resources around, finding a nice spot in the Dunley Farms while constructing the biggest castle I'd build in V Rising. We fought bosses throughout the world that helped unlock new crafting tables and even found myself a wicked set of guns. This game was no doubt a breath of fresh air. Without further ado, I spent 100 days in V Rising and here's what happened. Going through the character customization, I was trying to find my look, something that would appease the vampire gods. Welcome to Dido. This is his time, his, his playthrough. This is us, this is me, this is you. We're playing Dido. No, we're not playing Dido. We're, we're not playing that, we're playing V Rising. As we finished up with the character customization, we slowly awoke from slumber and in such a cool way, scribes and demonic looking sigils spawning outside the coffin. Now, with my first few steps taken, I jumped on down and continued towards Tutorial Island. <gasps> you can also turn it. Oh, I like that feature. Okay. Hello. Do we get enough bones? Not yet. I will get the bones container to... Ooh. Hey, we got the bones. Yeah. Ooh. It was definitely interesting the way the combat worked and how getting a new weapon would change our stance. Can you die, please? It actually did take me like a good 30 minutes to realize I could just easily rotate it instead of playing in one view, but I'm not going to show that. So picking up a few more bones along the way, I began crafting armor that was needed to progress the quest line. Looking through the map, I found a spot where we could start a base. <gasps> feed, 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 feed. Ooh. Okay, and then I feed, I feed, I feed, and then, ooh, ooh, my blood thing is filling up, and Tainful Hearts, okay. I also need to find some, some wolves. I think that's where we get the rugged hide, yeah. I see wolves, I see wolves, I'm coming. <gasps> feed, ho, oh, oh, ho, that one said 48%. Oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho, I'm guessing it's like a better buff. Finding a few not so friendlies just around the corner as well. All that was left to do was building ourselves a castle heart and clearing out a little campsite not far from me. Ah, here's a big baddie. Can we stop doing this? Oh God. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Okay, we gotta kill this guy. Oh, got him, got him, got him. How many do we have? 56, okay, okay, we're getting there. No, please, no, please. Oh, I don't want the sun. Gotta go back home, gotta go back home. Woo! No, holy mother. Yo, that thing is kinda sus, dude. On my way to building up a nice little fortress, the one thing I didn't so account for was space. Production, dominance. Oh, I'm burning! Okay, that hurts. What is, oh, this gives us a free cloud. Oh my God, that is beautiful. I love that. Okay, cool. As we took everything down, I thought the best way to set up a temporary base was the mist braziers. Keep the clouds above while building everything below. What I needed to work on next was clearing out more space and gathering all the wood possible, storing away anything non-essential. As I built a few sawmills near the castle heart, I knew I would need more wood. Oh, look at the spooky. Oh, that's why it's a spooky tree. Son of a gun. How am I supposed to beat this? I gotta use the axe. Okay, it's kind of working. I mean, as long as you know where like the range is on this thing, kind of easy to kill. Okay, well, we got down, but the tree. Jumping down off the cliffside, we looted up the remains nearby and found myself our very first crossbow. Oh, <gasps> so much stuff. Look at what the fuck just happening over here. Oh, sick. Yo, I might use that then. Going into the next day, what I needed was armor. A way for me to raise my gear level and some bonus HP. Now we can do copper. Woohoo, copper, okay. Now all we had to do was test out the new weapons. As we were lighting a few more braziers, there it was. Oh, uh, what the mother? Ooh, actually, I could do this. I could do this. I could do this. I could do this. Thing's almost dead too. Oh, he thought I was still there, baby. Let's go. Kill him. Oh, kill him, kill him, kill him. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's friggin' go. At last, the big trent of a tree was down for the count. That left me with chopping down more trees and some more and just a few more. Here's to see how the mechanics worked. We started tracking our very first boss as well. Actually, I guess while we're doing this, we could track some V blood, which we have to do this. Track blood. Ooh, what's happening over here? Oh, never mind. Oh, there it is. Hey, hold on. I got to kill you first. Oh, 
Hey, okay, that was a really easy battle. I like that. I think it's also stuck. <laughs> cool, okay. First blood down. Or I guess boss? Taste of knowledge. But that means we get uh oh this thing. Yeah, yeah, we get the wolf form now. And burp, 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 burp. Thinking that I was the stuff of gods, my ego had me planning my next move already. Very far. Oh, it says right there. Distance very far, far away. Well, no, it's actually just far away. Ooh, it's close. Wait, this is Rufus. So we're looking for like a big... Well, that went well. Okay, not really. But now I really had to be careful. Running back to the camp with Rufus, it was daytime and that left me feeling a little more nervous. The fight went on longer than anticipated, but with some extra protection standing behind a structure. Rufus was no match for us. Come on, just kill him. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. My gosh, take all. You're dead. 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 Don't worry. I got you, buddy. Hold to extract. You got it. Finally. Okay. Distant imminent. You mean dead imminent. Taking a little peek into the next boss I would fight, we had to deal with some very hot sun rays. While searching around throughout the night, I found a little archer hiding inside a tent. Okay. Wait, no, you're not. What's happening? Carrying silver? What? Oh, you can't carry silver? Oh, son of a bum. Okay. Your turn. No. <laughs> hey, no more freezing. Wait, I gotta drop uh, this, that, and what is this? Come here, give me, give me, give me. Extracting your blood, please. Woo, we did it, guys. We did it. All right, the next one I wanna do really quickly is go back. I wanna finish this one. So track that boy. The reason for doing more bosses than not was to farm up the rewards and build them in chunks as we went along. Vermin, a nest for vermin to get into your castle. Sure. Let's do a little vermin trap right here for now. We'll get one of these furnaces going. Research, no. Seeing that the next upgrade to the castle heart was indeed copper, next place would be the coal mine. Finding my way just outside the next location, this place was littered with baddies. Oh crap, oh crap. It only took a few more before I could start breaking down the copper vein. If there was one thing I was certain of, it was no one was going to stop me from taking the copper. Hello, Stonebreaker. This is the guy I was talking about. Oh, God. Okay, I gotta be careful. I like how he's just breaking all the rocks for me. Have you seen that? <laughs> just been going around. One of the coolest things about beating a boss in V Rising, the explosion that takes place right after defeating them. Anything around in a certain radius just blows up. And uh, ho ho, you better believe I took all that juicy loot home. All right, give your, you here, 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 tick, 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 tick. Yes, 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 yes. I also have to say, even without walls or something just built, I still enjoyed how my base looked. What I really wanted to work towards next was whetstone. Time to risk it for the biscuit. Oh wait, I can feed on you. I'll take the 77% on you, okay. Cleaning up a few more bandits nearby, I caught a glimpse of my nemesis. Oh crap, that's Tristan the Vampire Hunter. <laughs> it looks so official. While also having enough stones to get started on copper, that meant we needed to return back to base. Hoping that I actually had enough and not because of the Vampire Hunter, definitely not that. Oh, this is still better though. The Lumberjack Axe is, gives us 50% to wood. That's weirdly enough, still better i mean we'll keep it for now but after looking decked out and with some upgraded weapons i felt ready for a round two step one clear with the mobs and don't die step two bandit king okay this guy is is scary because this is a place of scary Intruders in the camp. touch all these because this armor i remember that i had before was invulnerable get him get him get him get him yeah 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 yeah, yeah. okay now i got to extract blood Give up. Never give up. Never surrender. Ooh, maybe we could go kill the other guy too then. I wouldn't stop there though. With another boss close by, it was time to get the ball rolling. Why is this person out here? I thought you would be like in a graveyard or something maybe? You're welcome. Of course, thank you. I should really be thanking you. You're the one giving me your blood as I extract it from your body. And we're gonna have so many more builds too. Just before the new day started here, we found ourselves in quite a predicament. There was a person I saw walking around. No, that was Tristan. That's oh no, 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 no. This is you. Okay. Come on, Gollum. What if I run and they fight? Oh 
god. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't know it was that. Okay, okay, that's fun. I mean, at least the stone golem's gonna be dead, too. Oh, I totally could have killed her. I thought I had a different move. That's why I used that. All I planned on doing now was working towards building a castle. I'm just trying to build a little thing around this grinder because I, I, it's right here. If you go to in confined castle room, what we're trying to build anyways is a castle because when you build the castle walls, it says, uh, by laying down the floors and building around the castle walls to generate a roof. I'll build the floors after I'm done with the walls. But we just have to put the flooring down after to do that. And when you build castle walls, they give you a roof automatically. It's great. It is fantastic. Something I will say, it hit me that I could just put the grinder in a single build than the bigger one. But hey, I build it. Uh, it's got a roof. See, look, it has a roof now. We're good to go. Bam. And then I'll put this back in here. With that said, I wanted to try my hand yet again. There's Lydia, the chaos archer. I'll kill him. Where'd you go? Here she is. Here she is. Woo, got him. Okay, this time you are mine for sure. Oh, we got the devourer and leather working station. That's cool. Okay. Oh, and small bag. Wicked. Looking into a new location here, I could really start building a base up. Ooh. ooh. Okay, we're getting stuff now. That's cool. A little bit of that. Okay, so next now. Wait, it's almost nighttime too. Perfect. Oh, that's so good. So we weren't finished with the act one bosses. Oh, what the fudge? Oh, wait, this is you. Can't move. I can't move. Oh, God. Oh, God. I don't like this. Finisher. Finisher. Woo. Got him. Got him. I'm coming. Nah, <laughs> you're coming to. Wait, to what? Something that I would have to rethink was the weapons or skill sets we would use. Because in this game, certain bosses actually can be defeated with certain weapons or skills a lot easier than others. I usually get set on my ways, so like I'll pick one weapon and I'll stick with it through the entire game. That can be a problem. As I got started on the next day, we were looking for a place to set up a portal. Time to find a new area was a go. Set on a new path, I knew I would need the required materials for a connecting portal back home. All I needed to do now was find me a location to call home. While clearing out more trees and rocks, I found the perfect spot for the next castle heart. Setting up a new portal so traveling was made so much easier. My biggest gripe would be moving everything from said base to new place. The hardest thing about all the back and forth wasn't even that. It was me just actually trying to build a pace. And you're going to see it in the beginning. It's, it doesn't look good. It doesn't look good. Thinking to myself, what was I going to build and how would the end product look? With a new day here, things felt great and looked even better inside. At least by now I had an idea. Maybe over there. What do we need for this? Stone brick. Want to see how much stone brick I've been farming? It's kind of crazy. This is only one grinder, by the way. I've been letting this go for literally way too long. I, <laughs> 200, 400, 6. Like, this is crazy. Okay. I don't know how to build. <laughs> I could, like, place, like, pillars to give it some more originality. Now, how many of those can I build? So this is what the house is so far going to look, or, like, castle so far going to look like. I'll do some more in a bit. I'm just kind of getting like the layout of this place. I haven't done bosses in a bit. I'm trying to build like a nice place first, you know? All right, the rugged hide and all that. I kind of like the rough look. It adds with the grass. It's really nice. Thing is, we won't be able to finish this upstairs parts just because the way this game works is you have to upgrade your castle's heart if you want to get more maximum squares. I've actually reached the limit now, but you get an idea of like how I'm going to be building this place. That'll be pretty sweet. We also started naming our chests for a faster way of storing items. As it was, I found my way searching for more bosses again. I could definitely say these two were not bosses. Okay, I gotta kill this guy. Kill him, kill him, kill him. Oh, baby. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go. Myself being that smarty pants of a person I was, this happened. Uh, hello? 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 Bandit Sulfur Camp. All right, I guess we're here. <gasps> oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I just killed myself. I thought those were crates. Oh, they were, but there was an explosive. So the death itself wouldn't stop me there. And I also wanted my stuff back. What I shouldn't have tried here was fighting the boss with it becoming daytime. That's a no-no. Oh, that was close. <laughs> 
I don't even think I was tracking this. Was this the guy I was tracking? Uh, oh, yes. That gives me the double. I think that's the double. There was like a double I saw. Wait, let's see. <laughs> All right. I like that. I still had no idea what the blood moon represented in game, but I was headed back home. Looking to the copper mines once more, I needed just a few more stacks. As our inventory was farmed up and we were ready to go, it was time to tackle the new location or a new boss close by. This one was located in the crypts and something I actually wasn't a huge fan of. Killed or dead or whatever you want to call it. At least I have to at least like kill this guy first. Another specimen has volunteered itself I see. Oh crap, what's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Oh, that's, that's okay. And then you're gonna jump to me. Oh, wait, no, never mind. Holy, look at all the skeletons. <laughs> Why is there so many? I mean, it's kind of cool, but no, 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 no. All right. Oh my God. That was kind of scary, actually. <laughs> really tough. My gosh. The spells help a lot, though. Those things are awesome. And socketing. I didn't know you could socket. That's cool. Corrupted. Wait, hold left alt to show possible stat rolls, which is 8 to 14%. See, that's the thing it doesn't show you, and I've noticed that on other games too, is when you see it's like increases damage by 10%, you're like, okay, 10% isn't that bad, but then you actually open it up 8 to 14%, which is actually really good. But I'm curious, should I give us the paper press and the corrupted skulls? Is this better? So this should? Because uh, like I, I'm doing the paper so we can get more upgrades. With a little more work to the base, it started coming along nicely. Second floor and doll. All right, I was about to freak out, not gonna lie, but I know where the paper went. <laughs> it went in here. Oh, that's so, I keep forgetting I have these bags. That's, I've got to get used to that. Oh man, I really have to get used to that. As the next day was setting in, I started traveling more of the map. I found myself looking for a new boss called Freya. What I didn't anticipate was me dying so easily to her. Don't get me wrong, I was a bit upset and filled with rage, but I knew that today would not go unfinished. Kill him! Kill him! Hear me. <gasps> Did I win? Oh, ho, ho, ho. God, it's the spirits, man. Those little guys, I can take the bosses easy. It's those little guys. Once the little guys come out to play, man, that is very scary. It's, it's very, very intimidating. I don't like it. Don't approve, but I'm going to pick all this stuff up. Anyway. And then we'll go. No, this one. With all those bosses before us and finished under my belts, I made it to my mission to finish up the base as much as I could. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Okay, this is Shadow Bolts, increases cast rates. Ooh, hmm, super tempted about that. Cast rate by 17%. Okay, research, research. Got a new torn banner, stone ornament. Cool, all right. All right, we got a lot of stuff going. What did that person give us again? Spray Walker. Oh, okay. So next would be the bear. And this gives us just like the, the bear power. South, east. So if we go to map south, east, which is like kind of far. So maybe I'll travel a vampire like over here. It was definitely nice having the floors done and with the additional crafting benches to furnish the place. I forgot I had multiple blood presses. I'm going to be honest. That looks okay. Man, I look silly there, huh? Oh, God. I need that. I think I needed uh, 16 planks. Coffin claim. Okay, now we got to use dominate to human convert people. Okay. A human into a servant. Interact with the servant. You Okay, unlock the castle throne. Do target one. Oh, below 30. Oh, there we go. Okay, I didn't know they had to be that low. I mean, that makes sense. Get inside. Blood quality, 10% expertise, rogue. This would be the last boss before fighting act one final boss. Truth be told, this was probably one of the easiest bosses in V Rising. It had very slow movements in between attacks and that gave me an opening to do my attack. Here we go. Dun, 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 the bear cave. Kill him. Kill him with fire! Kill him, kill him, kill him. Ba -da 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 -da. Oh god. We're gonna be like a snack, are we? <gasps> what? Okay, that <laughs> did not think it would be that simple. 
I mean, it is a bear. They're a lot slower, easier to kind of like, you know, call the movements and stuff, but gosh, okay. Well, I feel fine. Stronger. Oh, we do have bear form now too. Wicked. The final act led me towards this gated camp filled with a lot of bandits. Bear form. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Here we go. Oh, I love it. Oh, I love it. Oh, I want to feed on that. Am I feeding on the 40%? I hope so. As I cleared my way through, slicing and dicing everyone up, I got a little caught up and needed to wait the sunlight out. It's time to check my anger on some of these folks here. Gotta see where they are. All right, they're all, ooh, ooh, I see a nice chest. Give me that nice chest. Give me the nice chest. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. And, ooh. While nighttime was upon us, I knew exactly what I had to do next. Where is he? Where is he? I want the stone. Give me the stone. Oh, no, 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 no. The bandit king will die to my... Oh, God. What's he doing? <gasps> Did he hit me? I can't tell. No, 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 no. Oh, my God, tree. <gasps> oh, he's running. What's he doing? What's he doing? What's he doing? What's he doing? Oh, God. Three times? No. Oh, God. Oh, it hurts so much. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh. Oh, when you get so angry, you start clapping. So, so good. So good. So good. So good. Oh, my God. Can I just say, being that close and dying in such a way, not fun. All right? Not fun. Time for round two, please. He's gonna die. He's so gonna die. We're, like, so focused. We're just in, you know? This one. This one. This one. Boom, baby. Got him. Go ahead. It's what I would do. Looking to another victory, what I needed now was to raise my gear level. If I wanted to attempt my hand with act two bosses, then I knew we would need just a few upgrades. What I planned for and wanted, it didn't really happen until later on, but it was a garden, allowing for us to grow crops and then use them for recipes. Especially cotton. Cotton would become a big one. Being as happy as I was, no time like the present than to test out this sweet milk. I got the horse, I got the horse, I got the horse. <laughs> Yo, I did not know you could take the horse. Holy crap, and then you could just attack. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, cool. We gotta take a horse home. Hey, there we go. Horse, you are mine. This next part had my gut feeling so bad. I swear, if there was another way, I easily would have taken that. <gasps> what? Where did this man come from? What the f <laughs> Honestly, I thought someone threw a boulder at first, and then I saw the guy stand and, 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 and oh, okay. Oh, is that her? Oh, she's so, she's like a cutie. What? I, I have to, I don't want to have to hurt her. Beatrice the tailor, you're such a sweetie. Oh, look at you. What? Why is she running away? Oh, she's like an old lady. Do I have to do this? Kill her, kill her, kill her. I'm so sorry, Granny. I'm so sorry. Oh my God. I'm, I, I need to, I'm a vampire. Oh man, this one felt bad. This one felt really bad. Oh, this one felt so bad. Oh God, this one actually felt so bad. All right, so, oh, she even looks like a little granny. Oh. Today, I wanted to make sure we had the extra resources for later use. I would end up chopping hundreds of trees to fill our sawmills with, gathering the saw dust for later use in some paper presses. Being new to the game, I had no idea how important merciless weapons or tools actually were. In my mind, to get iron equipment or tools, I thought the Reaper was needed. Obviously, I was wrong, but here I am, ready to take on the next boss. How happy it truly made me, realizing we already had what was needed to mine the iron ore. Oh, next to none. I never tried, but ooh, there's something going on out there. Can I? Oh, <gasps> you can! You can totally mine iron! Oh! <laughs> Please don't be scared, people over there. Oh, there's a bunch of them over there. That's fine. We'll go this way then. The excitement definitely got the best of me though, because a slow and painful death was right around the corner. What? Okay. I guess it doesn't, it's not magic. Oh, that's, I mean, they're mages. Oh, that's fun. Okay. Though it wouldn't matter. 
I was dead set on mining all the iron up. Different parts of the caves too, like this little mine shaft. We had it all. Oh, <laughs> was... <gasps> no, no. Vincent the Frostbringer, that guy. I remember that guy. Oh, no, 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 no. That's not that guy, but that he's a big guy. So he reminds me of the other guy who gave me PTSD. Not happening. Mm -mm. Nope, not doing it right now. Coming up next on my to-do list, however, was the castle throne. All right, so here we go. Oh, ho, 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 ho. look at this throne. We're going to have to have a throne room. Or you know what? Actually, yo, we could put it right here for now. That's not too bad at all. Damn, look at this. Oh, what? Servant hunts. Left click to select a territory. I mean, what the heck not? Let's send this dude out there. I was so surprised with how it looked and how it felt for me to sit on. My butt was the comfiest butt around. Looking to gather some more iron, that's exactly where I was headed to next. Though what happened inside isn't what I planned for. It's also that time in the video, and if you made it this far, comment gloom rot down below. All I was focused on today was making my base feel more like a home. I wonder... Oh, yeah, 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 guys, guys, guys. Okay, so I did a bit more farming with iron. I, I'm, I'm going to show you. Don't freak out. <laughs> Each one of these has 40 plus, man. Look at that, 41, 41, 41. And we still got a full, like, stack thing there. Oh, Look at that, almost 200 pieces. Okay, so the next thing I wanted to do was production and then it was refinement? No, crafting, crafting. Because we're doing a smithy. We need 16 sulfur. A little bit of that. A smithy! <laughs> Look at these things. What the heck? Yo, I could legit build all of these. Oh, they are beautiful. And My this, that's, low. it's okay, don't worry. All right, we're getting the smithy stuff. Look at this go. Dun, 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 dun. If that didn't do it for you, then these next upgrades, oh, they definitely would. All right, what we got? We got the bow. We got the bow. Look at that. Look at that bow. Look at that bow. Uh, throw two axes in the shape of an X. <laughs> What's this one? All right, we got this bad boy. Let's see this one. We have that still, and then we have... Ooh, okay, it's like a backhand thing. Ooh, swing your Reaper, dealing that much damage, knocking them back. Throw Howling Reaper that spins in place over at that time. The initial deal is 50% slows. Let's see. Ooh, oh! Yo, that's really nice, actually. Holy crap. Thank you. Give me the cotton. All right, what about this side, though? You got some sunflowers for me? Hey. <gasps> Yo, it's Assassin's Creed! Oh, that's so cool. Yo, that is so cool. And then it uses it? Oh, sunflowers, excuse me, sir. <gasps> I could feed on the big guy. I'm going to feed on the big guy. Yo, that was so much easier than I ever thought possible. What the fudge? It was awesome. Oh, that is, that's a big one, huh? <laughs> Oh, that is... Okay, hold on. We're putting that upstairs for sure. Tailoring bench. Look at this thing. It's so cool. Oh. All right, what do we got? What do we... Oh, this is the hollow fang stuff. Oh, wicked. Hunter's cloak. Ooh, that is actually nice. By now, I personally felt like I beat the game. Of course, that wasn't the case, but it was just this, you know, personal growth, this achievement. Was I ready for the next boss? No idea, but I had to try. Oh, you, it's you. The sun priestess. We gotta kill the sun priestess. Okay, Tristan the vampire hunter? Gla oh, this person's the glass. Okay. Slashers, small coin purse, human. F what the fudge? I would get so close on multiple occasions, but it just wouldn't take. I might have to start switching up this spell, the aftershock. It's not bad, but I definitely need somehow more damage, and I don't know. Yo, this guy's fast. Why is he so fast? <laughs> oh god, oh god. What made things even harder was how much these two roamed the area. Apparently, it just wasn't in the cards for me though. So now here we were in a new area and trying to figure out what was next. It felt like I hit a wall, like a big wall. Not being able to progress much further just sucked so much. As I was on my way to a little camp, I had to take full advantage of what came next. Come on, let me just have this one. 
Come on, I gotta kill her. I will show you discipline. <gasps> kill her, kill her, kill her. Ooh, yes. Oh, thank goodness. Friggin. Ooh, you are a dangerous lady. But with those spells, okay, so I do have to switch some spells up. That makes sense. I will have to do that from time to time then. So much easier this time without the help of other bosses around. My goodness. What? Oh my god, that's a vampire hunter. What the fudge? <gasps> she has a silence too? Okay. Okay, we just need to run. Knowing that I wasn't ready to fight Jade, that had me thinking back to Tristan. Another vampire hunter, but definitely one more tamed. Which led us back into the Farbane woods, tracking down this vampire hunter with our blood scent. Uh, we're... Tristan, 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 Tristan. Hey, this one, Tristan. Is that him? Oh, that is him. Oh, he's fighting a big bear. Is he? Oh, no wolves. I was definitely no match for Tristan the first time around, especially with help always nearby. It made things twice as hard. The second time, however, let me let me tell you, things got a bit juicy. Oh, there we go. Got him with the last hit. You got to dodge into them. Go hit them. That's it. I'm just got to wait for the fire now. All right, Tristan, let's do this. Let's do this. Anyone call for a horde of mobs? How about a boss fight with our main man, Vincent? That definitely could have gone better, but now I knew what to expect. Wait a minute. Nope. Scratch that. Third time's a charm, right? All you could expect today was iron. Just mining and gathering iron. This next part of my playthrough, I really wanted to step it up with a garden. I would eventually need more cotton for yarn and other resources to build more advanced items. This took me all the way back to Freya's little garden, swiping on and gathering anything we needed. This also had us going into the Silverlight Hills, hoping to find more seeds we could plant, but not the case. Something that only just hit me now too was the entrance to these cave systems. They were like little teleporters planted all over the map for fast travel into random territories. Are you seeing this? Oh my god, the bats! I don't know what to expect. I've never actually found a cave like this, but I'm gonna do it anyways. <sighs> I hope it's good. Oh, I hope it's good. I hope it's good. I hope it's good. I hope it's good. Where are we? Uh, what the fudge? Wait, no, where am I? Oh my God, look at that. Bro, yo, this thing travels us, teleports us way. <laughs> Holy crap, that's far. Damn, I didn't know you could have caves set up like that. I know I'll get this question a lot or curious why I didn't do the newest of content, but there was just so much I didn't know and this was my first time playing the game. So Gloomrot would have to be in the next video. Running on home with a twinkle in my eye, the crops blossomed quite nicely. Can we farm them now? Oh, we can. You gotta love these things, man. What if, what if I just... Hey, cool. While all was said and done, we still needed some more upgrades to continue the base. That led me to tracking Leandra and someone who I would come to despise. Just before facing off with a boss who taught me real rage, we had to clear a bit of the mobs out. Next was a few skeletons and some necromancers laying about, probably some of the tougher minions I would fight. Oh, but it wouldn't stop there though. After clearing the minions out, I was finally ready for Leandra. As it turned out, so was she. Whoa, what the fudge is that? That thing is fast. What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? <laughs> no, 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 no. Ow, ow, ow. Don't like it. Crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Yep, I saw that coming. It didn't take me one try or two. It, it took me four. This priestess had killed me three times prior and quite brutally. The anger I was feeling almost had me taking a long break from the game. That and I was looking around to literally break anything. I was upset. It wasn't until my last attempt where I doubled down and focused on killing the minion summoned first. It was those shadow skeletons she would summon, leaping and jumping towards me with an attack. Even in the shadows, she had four or five of those skeleton brutes coming at us. Come on, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him! <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Come here, buddy. Come here, you. Leandra the Shadow. 
freaking just die, please. It was, however, a good day to just take in that big fat W. Now, I probably should have known better, but doing a little exploration never hurt anyone, right? Ooh, uh, level 50. Terra the Geomancer. Hmm, don't know if I want to do that right now. You know, just not feeling that. Filling out some more of the Dunley region was the name of the game and something I just personally wanted to achieve. As much as the base needed more build and more room, probably an upgrade or two with the castle heart as well, I was set on finding this glass blower. It seemed harmless enough and filled with so many quartz in this mine. Okay, you're definitely down there. If this is the, yeah, this is quartz area. You're definitely down there. You just gotta be careful now. Okay, this person has to be in here. Like, there's, oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. You just made a big mistake. Me? A big mistake. Oh, crap. Impressed? Not really. Woo! What the fudge? Ooh, we got poisonous stuff. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh my god, okay, okay, those play a big part in this song. Yeah, I, I'm unfortunately not going to be able to do that. I want to really badly, but they're too strong. They're too strong. I don't like it. I'm leaving. Something that definitely irked me was the needing to switch up spells or weapons for certain bosses. It's not that they were impossible, it just made it that much easier if you had a certain weapon or spell. I would have preferred to do things my own way, but hey, it just made sense following the rules of V-Rising and the way they had things set up. Alright, artisan table, look at this thing. I think it's friggin' cool. Love the design too. Ooh, so different rings and we can do Scourge Stone Pendant. Oh, I need 12 of those. <gasps> Look at it. It's creating stuff. Oh, 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 I like that. But now we need, so it was crude emerald. We have exactly four. My goodness. Oh, hopefully. Like, I'm just thinking it will be a bit better. The 4% movement speed isn't better than none. My thinking is so. Oh, cotton's right here. Yeah. <laughs> All right. No, not the blood press. What am I doing right here? It's this thing. It's this big old thing here. We don't have the boots. Ooh, look at that. 35, 378. Oh, almost 400. All right, potion time. Nope, don't, just don't, don't, because the then they will. Just for I don't want to feel the bird. I don't want to feel the bird. Okay, this I got to watch, because when these explode, man, these get dangerous. Ooh, so you can push them out of the way. Okay. Oh, God, I got to. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Oh, God, oh, God. Okay. Not really. I mean, not as much as I should be. <gasps> oh, no, 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 no. Get him. Get him, get him, get him. All right. That was so much easier, man. Oh, just upgrading a little bit of gear. Getting like a little more, especially the mage, the mage thing with this thing. Oh my God, that was beautiful. Just make sure you hit it. It gives you a free mage that does damage. Oh, it's all good. While that was said and done, we had another boss close by. Someone by the name of Maja the Dark Savant. All right, we're close. We're close, baby. We are close. Wolf thread. That's fine. Just over here, Militia Comp. So wait, who am I fighting again? The Forbidden Tower. Wonder why it's forbidden. Oh, look at the tiling. Oh, I need to do that with my place. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, this is so cool. I hope I don't die. Crap, there's like no... Oh, I guess it's a closed portal. Oh, look at this place, guys. Maja the Dark Savant. All right. Um... Who dares to disturb me? Not me, I swear. Not me. Ow. 
Ooh, ooh, what the fuck? Ah! <laughs> so much paper. Ow, what the fuck? Exquisite so watering of the paper cuts. Are you really paper cutting me to death? This is kind of sick. Ah, it hurts. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. This is gonna turn. Wait, no, it's not. Oh, please don't kill me here. This boss was definitely someone I had to switch spells up with too. Maybe I'll do range. Who dares to disturb me? Oh my god, dude, I need more jumps or something. Oh, like, okay, this one is interesting because she's using all of her minions. We have to kill the minions as quickly as possible. Yeah, bow and arrow is not great because they move too much and I just need better, like, damage stuff. You know, you know, you know. Will hinder my research. You gonna teach me something? All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Do you also Lend me your power. No, 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 no. <gasps> we did it we did it we did it oh my god we did, it. we did it i just went for the kill i just went straight for the kill oh my god yes 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 <sighs> why is there but why is stuff spawning now what hello can you stop give me please 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 thank you thank you so much oh my god what do we get what do we get what do we get okay we got a spell which is Dashboard's input direction elude nearby enemies. Okay, yep. Deal 25% bonus damage. Spawns an illusionist. Launches projectile inflicting weaken and granting phantism. We got the scrolls we needed. Yep. Reinforced plank. Thick oh crap. How do you get re Yo, she kinda cute though. What the fudge? Yo, look at those eyes. That tattoo. Oh, hello. Okay, I see you. Damn, I see you. While continuing my little adventure around the map, the majority of what I set out to do was done. Look at it. Now I was looking to find a space to start a garden in and for us to really expand on what my base offered. This is what it looked like. I enjoyed it, but part of me also wanted more space for planting seeds down. Also, Vincent the Frostbringer. Oh yeah, him. You remember him, right? Yeah, easy as pie. Even the little minions, the big brawlers themselves felt so much easier than before. Wait, Imminent? Where is Imminent? Is it you? It is! What the fudge? Yo, this man was sneaky beaky the entire time. I don't approve of that, but okay, I kind of like that too. I'm not gonna lie. What the fudge is that? Ow, make it stop, make it stop. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh, my god. Oh, this man was sneaky beaky to the max. My eyes are bleeding. Ah, I, just, I just gotta take this man alive now. If I take him alive, not take him alive. Not gonna lie, that was different. Vi Whoa. Yo! Skirmishing great spear shattered the shards of magical weapon. Unusable in its current state. Bring to Ancestral Forge to restore it. Holy crap! Look at that thing. Oh my god. That is so nice. I didn't know you could get better weapons like this. Ooh wee. <laughs> okay. So going to the next one. We got that. Oh, it is you. With all the bosses fought and beaten, to all the new crafting tables we now had, I needed space and what I had bothered me a little bit. I also wanted to give all the builds their respective flooring to save on resource costs for crafting or smelting so, items uh, down. Okay, now we gotta figure out a way to move all the chests. I like having the window thing. I don't know why. And then I guess windows, you just, you'd fill them in. All right, we are doing some serious overhaul again. Put some pillars out here. Give it something for now. Create a little cloud. Well, we have a lot more space now for all that stuff. So we'll have all the building stuff in that downstairs. I guess that's changing. Our, yeah, yeah, changing our looks. Okay. 
Honestly, I would like to spread these out more. At first, I was hoping to use the castle heart as a way to build off of. Do we have a woodworking bench? Do we have simple? For tailoring, we need tailor, flooring, forge, flooring. This is going to be the forge section. Then it hit me. Expand the rooms for each main table we had. Even upstairs became something new, something else entirely. So with this part of the castle, I didn't have enough flooring to actually finish it off, so we would have to wait a bit. Man, the castle felt great here. Oh, <laughs> look at this lovely place. I've got all of my tailoring. Yep, this is the workshop place. We got all of our forgy place. Don't have a library yet. That's why there's a few things still out here. But here's the, wait, hello. The forge. Hello, Forge. Look at you. You're beautiful. This, I don't really know what it is going to be. I, maybe, I don't know. Might make it some sort of storage facility place. For now, I'm using these just because they give me more, or I mean a lot more space. I think it's like 28. It's crazy. Crazy stuff. Now with it feeling more spacious than ever before, we could finally set out to finding another boss. Someone by the name of Terra the Geomancer this time. Let me just say, this was probably one of the easiest boss fights. Easier than the Ferocious Bear, surprisingly. All right, I'm ready, Miss. Miss Geomancer, let's go. <gasps> let's go, let's go, let's go. You gonna summon a big boy? Or what are you doing? That's a big one. That's a really big one. Oh, no, she transformed into the golem. Oh, okay. <laughs> Look how big you are. Oh, God, you got golems. You think you could kill me? Me? Wow, I really like this boss. It's kind of cool. Get back, get back, get back, get back, get back. Oh, did I kill you? Yeah, oh, yeah. Whoop, got him. Didn't, that wasn't even me. That was just my skill. How do you like them apples? You probably don't, right? Yeah, I know. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. Hey, don't worry about it. Gem cutting table. And now we can start doing this. Oh, we could actually craft gems now. Oh, okay. Hold on. I'm curious. What is, what is, wait, is that, hold on. Was that a, a spell or was that a, oh, it's an ultimate. Ooh, okay. I'll take that actually. All right. And then now the next bosses are, oh crap. They're not even unlocked. I had, well, okay. To be fair, I think we actually need to have at least gear level 50. Doubling back to the top floor of the castle, I needed a bit more sulfur to finish this up. Yeah, this is a sulfur quarry. This is Bandit's stronghold. I think I'm gonna go over there, actually. That led me to the Farbane Woods with a little sulfur mine down below. I did my best to avoid as many people as I could, but sometimes you just can't. Breaking down any sulfur and gathering what we could, taking it back to base. Ooh, you know what we could get first? Hold on, I'm gonna go get my, my crops. I haven't touched them in a minute. While being back at home, the garden actually looked so much better with things growing back organically. So as I planted down a few more seeds to fill in some plots, I checked on the castle heart. Level three. Oh no, it's level three to four. Okay, so we need radium alloy. Uh, well, I mean, wherever that is, that sounds pretty cool, but I feel like I don't know where that is yet. No clue at all where radium alloy would even come from. All right, do we have the bonus? We got the bonus, has matching floors. What about these ones? Let's see, let's see, let's see. Come on. Yeah, look at that. Okay, good, 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 good. As I was looking through more of the V-Blood, which was how I tracked bosses, I found her. All right, we're doing this. Oh, she's close too. What the heck? That's actually kind of sus. I don't like that. <laughs> this chick is like super strong, so. Ooh, Jade the Vampire Hunter. Hello, baby. How you doing? Hello. You better stick around. Dead set on finally fighting Jade, she was gonna give us our first real guns in the game. Though it wouldn't come without any struggle. Oh, she silenced us, right. One shot, one kill. No, 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 no. Ah. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Dance, puppet, dance, dance, baby, dance. Oh, crap, oh, crap. We, got, we gotta make her. Okay, we got, we got a, we got a crazy one. Dance for me. I don't want to dance. 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 Should we not do this right now, dude? Let them fight. Let them fight. Let them fight. They're gonna fight. They're gonna fight. They're gonna fight. Or not? Okay. Where are you? Where 
are you? I'm very close. Okay, cool. Damn. Well. Oh, 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 you guys don't understand. That was so obnoxious. I hated it. Oh, I loved it. It was so good. Oh my god. Okay, extract all the bloods, please. Oh crap. Wait, you don't hit me? Oh. Cool. When I'm extracting blood, you, you can't hit me? I like it already. Hey, I would kill you too. Oh, guys, guys, are you ready? Are you ready? Are you freaking ready? Oh, I'm gonna end it on the biggest note ever because God dang it. Oh, we got pistols. Oh, man. You better believe you know I'm using pistols now. We had them. We actually had them. And testing it out is all I could think about. <gasps> wait, wait. Oh. What is this? Black powder haters? Ability modification. Yo. Yo, 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 yo. That's a gun. That's a gun. That's a gun. Oh. <laughs> but what is Ancestral Forge? I don't, I don't know what that is. So I'm going to have to wait. <laughs> Crafting of the pistols, which would be yeah, 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 iron and then planks. Okay, pew, 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 pew. Ooh, we got a rollback, so pew, 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 and then you could do pew, pew, pew while they're attacking that, and then we have the casting of this. So we pew, pew, pew. <laughs> That's gonna be so sick. What did go horribly wrong was with the next few days. Me trying to test out the guns on this other boss, Octavian the Militia Captain. What I didn't realize was how hard the next one would actually be or the amount of deaths I would stack up. The hardest part was getting to the next fight. The little minions to the big brawlers would not leave me alone and really tested my patience. 97%. Did you see that? Look at that. 97. I know it's a brute, but still, man. Oh my God. 97%. Let's freaking go. So here I was, ready to conquer the world and defeat the next boss. No! Oh, come on! Oh my god, this is... Okay, okay, yo, those little people need a... Oh, it's... Blade, 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 blade. Holy crap, holy crap, holy crap. Uh, I need HP. Here's an old trick. Okay, 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 okay. Not the end. And I died. I died to sunlight. I died to sunlight. No way I could die again, right? Wrong. So very wrong. <laughs> and in one fell swoop, another death loomed over us. Why do they keep doing the fire? Like, why? Why do they keep doing the fire? Oh my god, I want to break something. I want to... <clears throat> okay, probably shouldn't... <clears throat> probably shouldn't have done that at daytime. I mean, I did pretty good for being stuck in a corner, so I'm not gonna get angry at that. I know, I know, I know, I know. Was I done there though? 56 days, four hours and two minutes later, the last round I would go. Either me raging or taking that big fat W home. Come on, come on, come on. On. I just gotta stay away from the blades. Oh god, like that. Like that. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, we did it. We did it. We did it. He spun the one into death. He spun the one into death. How is he so stupid? And he killed me so many times. Oh. Oh. You know what tasted so good today? It was me beating that boss. What didn't feel great though was the reward we got for beating him. You are the prickiest prick to prick ever prick. I wanna say a lot of bad words. I'm not going to. I'm going to keep it cut out because you're such a prick. Mm. This boss was one of the worst bosses I've ever had to fight in my life. Oh my God. So while sorting through some more inventory and gathering up what crops finished growing, I really felt like my base was missing something and feeling like I needed more resources. Seeing that radium alloy was next on my list, that meant we needed to prepare for the next journey. So now having some gates to the new base built, there it was. Base Renovations 3, baby. Wait, no, 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 no. Hold on. Where's the big door? Over here. Time for the big gates. All right, let's see. How does this work? Oh, oh! you see that? Oh, 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 oh look at that. Oh, boom. Bah. 
Boom. Oh, that's so cool. It started with the front portion of the base. Seeing that more could be added and used to its full potential. Next, I needed to move the stairs, but kept having this weird cannot break path to ground message. All that meant was we needed another staircase to hold the base up while deconstructing the one we had. I placed down some more floors to fill in the area, taking down beams and looking to add a new set of stairs somewhere else. All was good in the world as we started fixing up the second floor here, feeling so much more spacious and basically giving every entrance the double doors. I even started moving my storage area to a smaller room, getting rid of some extra bookcases and keeping things really pristine. I moved a few things around in the forge area, jumping around the base and placing down light sources to brighten each room up. I did add some nice cobblestone floors leading to each room as well, giving it some pop and more contrast. Nothing like being home and soaking up the changes. Before I go, just look at this place. Just look at it. It actually is coming along really nicely. Eventually, you know, there's going to be more upgrades to it. There's going to be things changed, stuff like that. But for now, it's not bad. It's not bad. Apparently, I'm going to need a lot of radium and silkworms. And I don't, I just don't know, you know? One thing I do need is fish bones. Fishing was also something I really should have started from the beginning. Getting bones was hard enough, but fishing had a low percentage. Things you fished up was at random from iron ore to even bones. I was also tricked into trying my hand fighting through some holy radiation. If I wanted in, we needed potion. All right, so we need to go back home because it hurts. It hurts, it hurts, it hurts. Doing just that, however, as I checked my alchemy table for what we needed, I gathered up the required materials from the storage as we started this next part. Just before nighttime took over, I wanted to test out the new ultimate we had, see if it was worth keeping. The last thing to do was test it out on another boss, one that would give us the Ancestral Forge and allow for me to finally repair broken weapon. With the potion successfully protecting us from the holy radiation, this was my one shot to make it count. Please tell me the potion is still on. Please tell me the potion is still on. Oh my god, are you kidding me? I'm having such a wonderful time now. So while backtracking just a little bit here, I had to avoid those who killed me and make my way to the cathedral. You are in here. I know you are. Okay. Okay. This is big boy boss guy time. Oh God. No, 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 no. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ooh, hello. Whoa, 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 no, I don't want to kneel before the lights. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. Please, 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 please. This will kill him? Oh god, I got him, 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 I got him. Ooh, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. We killed another one. This one was surprisingly easy. We did it. We beat the boss. Oh gosh, okay. While making my way home, it was a pretty dangerous game and one I played well. Didn't die or nothing. Although we did have a few close calls being back in the Silverlight Hills. That place was scary, man. I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to. I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to. Oh my God, 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 oh my God. Oh my God. All that was left to do now, build the last two crafting tables dealing with gemstones. I was curious to see what else we could upgrade and what more I could achieve. The moon is rising. Great time because I'm not going out. Mm, ancestral Forge. Definitely not doing that. Wait. Jewel crafting workstation used for crafting of jewels. But what do you use the jewels for? Gem cutting. A workstation used for combining lower quality gems into higher quality gems. We have Aftershock. We have a basic cooldown, which is not bad. Basic cooldown is always decent. Increases projectile range by 19%. Reduces cooldown by 10%. Whoa. That's so much nicer. I like that one. What the heck? Bonds a second illusion when recasting. Wait, when recasting, dealing 66% of the original damage inflict. I gotta try it again. I gotta wait, hold on. We have increased projectile range by 90%. So it aftershock. So it shields ally skeletons hit by the recast. Oh, so the ones that spawn, if I use it quickly enough. I mean, it's oh, that's not bad. That's definitely not bad. But like, oh. Again, we didn't do everything, not even close, because the biggest update was the Gloomrod update. 
If you guys do want to see the gloom rod update you want to see more of this please let me know in the description down below and as much as that is said i have to say thank you guys so much for hopefully taking an interest into this uh this game <laughs> v rising it's, it's been nice it's been refreshing it's it's a different game for sure this one definitely has a lot more rpg elements to it which i love personally the base building is beautiful it is i wish i could build more floors but hey i hope you guys enjoyed this though i can't thank you guys enough for all of the support you guys have just shown me and done so much for me so just thank you thank you thank you thank you i will catch you in my next video just thank you so much <laughs> this is raya pandas signing out bye guys bye everybody